Bucks are going to be three captain rule in the USA team this weekend. Good continuity though, and oh, the big hit comes in. That's the first shot of the weekend. From the outside looking in, it just looks like an aggressive, rough, tough sport. But I feel like the culture within it, even between teams, is like so amazing. Through rugby, I've just grown into a confident woman that I don't know if I would have become without it. They almost praise me for my size, which you don't get in culture today. You know, you're not praised for your size. When you when you lose weight, that's when you get praised. I love it when I get called all that. When I get called big girl and look at how look how thick she is. I'm like, yes, that this body has let me be a pro athlete and let me be an amazing player. So Part of what inspires us is helping to unify our country, especially at such disjointed times and moments over the last few years. We want to be that team that everyone can rally behind. We have the women's national team for soccer, but we're right there and we're a strong group and we want to inspire that next generation of rugby players, but not just women, men too, and not just rugby, right? Like, it's. It's a really cool sport, it's so fun to watch, and I think that's how we can draw people in. But then the culture that we represent, I think will keep people around and interested in just showing the unification of our country. It's tough, but it's also kind. <laughs> it's kind of like what I feel about myself. Like I feel like I'm tough, but I can still be kind, and maybe that's some of the reasons why I love the sport. Physical stuff from Canada. Farella going to work now. Winding up the intensity in the huddle at half time. They come out here to make defensive plays, but on this occasion. <laughs> one day at a time. I mean, you know, you don't become an Olympian overnight. It takes, you know, minute by minute, hour by hour, every single day um, to, to keep the focus and, and whoever's going to be most present out there um, is going to win that gold medal.